Now, your KSBW weather forecast with Chief Meteorologist Lee Solomon. Good evening, everybody. We'll take a look at the afternoon high temperatures, which, if you were by the coast, yeah, it was a struggle. 60 at Aptos. You get up into the hills, though, you're above that marine inversion, mostly 70s to around 80 degrees. And again, anywhere near the coast, low 60s, Moss Landing. Then you got 70s, Watsonville, 80s, Moss in, from, let's say, Morgan Hill to Gil But, you know, normal high temperature this time of year, 88. Uh, so we're well below average. And the whole summer's kind of been like that, really, with little spits of heat, but not much. King City, 83, 70 here in Salinas. So if you had the sun, it made a huge difference. And if you didn't, of course, it was a gray day around the bay. 60 in Carmel. Overnight lows are like mid-50s, right? So you are only got a five-degree spread between what's going on at night and in the middle of the afternoon. Not much change there. Uh, low clouds were tough all the way down the Big Sur coastline, all the way to Santa Barbara. Clear and hot for Fresno and Bakersfield today. No thunderstorm activity, though, really across the state. We got two areas of low pressure, and that's really what's happening in terms of the rest of the week. Uh, normally, we'd have a big old high pressure ridge out here. That really hasn't set up that often this year, so uh, we're doing more of the cool than we are the hot, and these are slowly advancing on us, so that will keep the cool air coming on in. And eventually, uh, as these kick inland over the course of Friday through Saturday, some parts in Northern California might pick up a couple of showers. I don't think we'll see anything down here, uh, but we'll keep a watch on it. Forecasted highs for tomorrow. If you're traveling a little last uh, summer vacation time here, 91 in Sacramento, so they're down, right? So they're not that hot. 79 in Lake Tahoe and 102 in Vegas. So the heat's still out there, but it's down in the deserts. 102 Palm Springs, 76 uh, San Diego, 80s in LA. But again, you get into Santa Clarita, places like that, you're at, you know, you're at 100. Uh, so it's hot once you get away from the coast, anywhere really in California, 99 in Redding, 60s up in Eureka. Take a look at the local program here. Low clouds filling down the valleys later tonight. Uh, by the bay, it'll be a bit of fog, could be some mist uh, and drizzle. So again, we'll uh, work on that for the overnight. And then tomorrow morning, you're looking at overcast skies. We're going to do a slow clearing tomorrow. We may end up clearing a little bit better. Uh, tomorrow afternoon. This is 11:15. We'll start that clearing, and then we'll clear up a little bit more in the late afternoon. So all in all, again, one of those days where uh, the coast will have limited sunshine. But if you do get it, it'll be late in the day. Uh, 50s for the overnight bay fog and mist. Low clouds will push inland, and then we'll do more 60s and low 70s uh, as low clouds and fog again are slow to clear with a cool bay breeze. For tomorrow, for the valleys and hills, it's mostly 70s. We will see some 80s. You're going to be out at the pinnacles, probably 90, uh, but they're easy 100, 102 this time of year. Uh, mostly sunny, mild temperatures overall with 60s in San Francisco, 70 in Oakland, 80 in San Jose, 84 in Los Gatos. Again, the hills uh, looking at middle and upper 70s, 80 in Boulder Creek, low 70s, Santa Cruz, 61 in Aptos. Around the bay, 70 Watsonville, 64 Moss Landing, 65 Prunedale, 70s in San Juan Batista, low 80s, Gilroy, Morgan Hill, again running 5, 10 degrees below average, but hey, very pleasant. I don't think we'll get a lot of complaints out of those kinds of temps. Upper 60s, Salinas, middle 70s, Gonzales, you're at 80 in King City, and then you continue that warming trend, you're heading to Parkfield, Bradley, Lake Nacimento, you should top off right around 90 degrees. Low 60s should do it. Seaside, 66 in Monterey, 60 PG, 61 in Pebble, 70s, low 70s, Carmel Valley, and a 76 in Big Sur. Taking a look at your KSPW 8-day forecast. The coast will stay steady. Low clouds morning and night, a little sun in the afternoons, and then a little warmer as we head towards next week with maybe less of those low clouds. The valleys and hills will stick with mild temperatures for a couple of days, mostly 70s to around 80 degrees, and then a little warming trend into the weekend. We're back to 70s and 80s with even some 90s maybe in the warmer spots next week. Okay. Yeah. Very good.